Quadragax, once one of the largest crypto exchanges in Canada, has announced that its creditors will receive an interim dividend of 13% of their total claims. Ernst & Young, the company's bankruptcy trustee, released a notice on May 12 to inform creditors of the distribution. According to the notice, the dividend payment will represent approximately 87% of the funds the trustee is currently holding. The remaining funds will be kept in reserve for future disbursements. There have been a total of 305.6 million CDN 2 to 3 million worth of claims made by 17,648 creditors, with just 15 creditors owed more than $1 million. Quadragax became insolvent in 2019, following the death of its co-founder and CEO, Gerald Cotton. Former users of the exchange mostly held crypto assets at the time of its collapse. However, their claimed holdings were converted into the monetary value of the asset as of April 15 that year. If someone held one Bitcoin, worth $26,791 at the time, they will eventually receive 6,739 CDN 4, 933, with 13% of that coming as an interim dividend. It has not been specified when the interim dividends will be distributed, but Miller Thompson, the law firm representing the creditors, has suggested that it will occur over the next few weeks. The Canada Revenue Agency is one of the largest creditors owed 11.7 million CDN worth of back taxes from 2016 to 2018. Overall, the announcement of an interim dividend provides some relief for Quadragax's creditors, but it remains to be seen how much they will ultimately recover.